Hey loves, welcome to the channel. Hope you are all doing well. So in this week's video, I'm going to share with you guys a few summer hygiene must-have that I'm currently in love with. These are products that have been tried and tested over the last few months, along with a few new faves. As usual, all the items mentioned will be in the description box below. So definitely go ahead and check that out if you are interested in any of the items mentioned. So with that being said, let's get into these products. <laughs> so it's summer and most persons will be showing off a bit more skin than they normally do. So for that, we want to ensure that the skin is looking the best it possibly can. And that includes getting the foundation right. So starting off with our body wash, I picked up two body washes i've used the natrium line of products before and guys yes it is a slightly bit more expensive than the normal body wash but it definitely gets the job done so for the summer season the one that i'm currently using is the natrium the smoother glycolic acid body wash so this is what it's looking like and as you heard it has glycolic acid in it and we know that that is good for like just removing like bumpy uneven textured skin removing all that dead cell from your skin and ensure that it just looks a bit more polished a bit more smoother and looking pristine so i really love the scent and the texture of this one it's really soft smooth gives you a nice little ladder if you love dove body wash but sometimes that can be a bit too moisturizing and you prefer to be like having a middle ground i feel like this is a good balance it does leave you feeling clean but at the same time it is very moisturizing i don't know how they were able to formulate it like that but i'm pleasantly surprised by it and i love it i actually love this one this one it was for 18 pounds so for all my uk girlies you'll be able to get this from space and k so that's where i got this one along with that i also picked up the mario body skew i think that's the name of this brand if you're an og beauty lover you know that this line of product it's good it is top tier back in the days i used to use their body not their body wash their face wash i don't know why i stopped using that i don't know why like when it just came to the uk that was my go-to face wash and it did it did what it was supposed to do so probably i need to go back to that because your girl has been like going all over and i feel like after a certain time of using a certain product it just stopped working for me anyways back to the body wash so as i said this is the mario body skew body wash it is the haa botanical body soap and very similar to the natrium glycolic acid it also has ah a in it and again that helps to remove textured skin removing all the dead cells dead skin cells from your skin and just leaving it looks again very polished and feeling very smooth so both of them i'm in love with this one it has a nice little citrus scent to it and i love the ladder on it it does leave me feeling very clean not too squeaky clean there's a slight moisture element to it but it does leave you a feeling a bit more clean like you know that squeaky clean feel to it so yeah i've been alternating between these two i think this one was for nine pounds so half the size of this one and also half that price so if you guys wanted like to try out a bit more what i would say science based body wash something that has a bit more active ingredients then these are a good purchase not only for the summer season but all year round all year round if you are looking for a good body wash so for the lotions the two that i'm currently in love with i've spoken to you guys about this one this is the natrium bio liquid restoring body lotion and back in winter i was saying like oh it's a bit too lightweight for the winter season but i feel like it's perfect for the summer season it's a very lightweight so it doesn't leave you feeling that sticky icky feeling that you can get from some lotion when they're too thick this is the perfect texture perfect amount of moisture for summer 
and guys this is almost done so i really need to top up that because i've been using this non-stop since it's gotten a bit more warmer in the uk moving on to my other recommendation and it's the rain haa body renewal serum again this one has a very lightweight feeling to it so it doesn't feel leave you feeling too like thick it's not too sticky it's very lightweight and moisturizing at the same time so what i love about this one is the scent and it also has the active ingredient which is aha i don't know but for some reason like right here on my arms they just been feeling a bit mm, for the last few months and i'm like no i need to work on that so i went ahead did my research and that's how i end up getting this and i must say i've seen a difference especially in my back i don't know if i was developing a back acne but this has helped so going forward this is going to be a staple in my little stash so if you're someone like me and you have so many different shades on your body i feel like my face is one shade my chest is another shade and then my legs is a completely different shade i don't know i don't know what you call this a multi-shade person then you need to get a bronzing lotion i know Back in the days, you used to think like, oh, bronzing, tanning product are, are for a certain race. But I'm here to tell you like, that's not the case. Anybody, anybody can use bronzing tan slash tanning products. So this one, I picked it up last year. And this year again, I just instantly draw for it. So if I'm going out and I'm wearing like anything that is a bit more revealing like shorter skirts mini dress then i'm going for this so this is the palmer's cocoa butter formula natural bronze body lotion and it just gives you a gradual tan so if for instance i know i'm going out next weekend i'm just constantly applying this throughout the week to ensure like i develop a nice little tan i would say it's not drastic but it does make a difference so if you're looking for like something that is black girl friendly and it's also lightweight and it smells amazing because who doesn't love the scent of cocoa butter i know i do then this is a good alternative for you a good recommendation so let's be honest would it really be a summer beauty haul if i wasn't mentioning some spf product so I mentioned this one before, but you girl went and did a re-up. So again, this is the Garnier Anti-Dark Spot and Anti-Pollution Super UV SPF 50 Plus. I love this one because not only is it affordable, but it does the job. It's very lightweight. Sometimes I feel like it can be a bit more greasy i don't know if it's me sometimes it seems a bit more greasy sometimes it's okay i don't know if it's just like my body and like you know you're sweating a bit more but it does the job but yeah this is very affordable and it's very effective and guys before i didn't really know the importance of using spf because i was thinking like oh i don't really need to use my spf i'm not even going out in the sun that often i'm just walking but i realized even in the winter time if i'm using the spf all over like all year round my dark spots aren't that dark yeah i have spots but like they aren't as dark as how they used to be before i started using spf and since i realized that this is a staple all year round so don't be one of those persons that only use spf during the summertime and then as winter come you're like uh no i don't have a need for it if you have dark spots if you have like any form of hyperpigmentation then you need to use spf because it just helps to prevent them from getting any darker so definitely go ahead and get yourself an spf and as i said use it all year round not only in the summer Make sure you are listen. <laughs> so yeah, moving right along. I've also been loving this Nivea SPF Lip Balm. So this is what the packaging is looking like. Very simple. And what I like about it, because at first I was thinking like, oh, you know what everyone is like, they are so into an SPF that doesn't leave a white cause. I was kind of wondering like, oh, would a lip balm, would it be the same thing? Would it leave a little white cause or anything like that? And surprisingly, it doesn't. So I'm really happy about that because I can't really comment on like how effective the SPF level is because I haven't really seen much difference. 
can't really say but just for peace of mind i feel like it's good to have like an spf lip balm especially during the summer season and this one it is the moisturizing level is very long lasting so you don't need to be reapplying that often so i know for a lot of persons they don't like bearing spf with their makeup or even using lotion along with it because it just makes the face feel heavy and I, it's just too much products to be wearing all at once so if that's you and you just feel icky when you're wearing that much products on your face and it's hot like you just can't be bothered with like all the extraness then i have a good alternative for you so this is the 456 skin mila skin reset so this one it says it's step four is the hydrating product and i don't know I, w I didn't really look into it at first because it's a liquid i'm like hydrate like what is it exactly but i did do my laser research and i've been using it now for the past two weeks so basically the idea behind this is that it can be used to replace your lotion so let me just go ahead and give you guys a little pump test so it's like a serum like for your face so if you're moisturizing you just need to use like two pump two pump is good enough and it just makes your face feel so smooth so moisturized it doesn't feel like dry or anything like that like if it's it looks like an actual lotion it looks like an actual lotion in your face you just don't get that sheen or anything like that so yeah this is what it's looking like after lotioning so if you're like me and you have dry face and like sometimes your face is flaking then this is a good alternative as well because i realized that whenever i'm using this i don't have any flake like my dry patches aren't showing up it just keeps them toned down for the entire day and i was pleasantly surprised by that because i have little dry patches on my face and then sometimes you know your lotion and then you have on your makeup and then you just see the little patches coming up the little dry bits coming up i don't like that but since <clears throat> sorry but since i started using this it just keep them down so that is a good alternative a good option in general if you're someone that struggles with that or you don't like using too many products on your face then this one is a very lightweight it feels as though you're putting water on your face so you guys see it looks moisturized but it just doesn't have that extra sheen and like shiny look that you can get sometimes when you do use face creams so sticking along the same line, if you're just like having a bit of coverage on your face, but in the summertime, using foundation is just a bit too much, then this is a good recommendation. So this is the 8cc plus nude glow and it also has SPF in it. So if you're using this, you don't necessarily need to use SPF because this is SPF 40 and I'm using it now. As you can see it does give you a little blur it doesn't really cover all your blemishes but it's a good little blur it makes your skin just look a bit more even out and i love it very lightweight i just use like two pumps and that's it so this is the spf cc cream from it and it's medium coverage and it has a bright name glow serum in it so i feel like this is a good summer pickup this is something that you need to have for the summer period if you don't get anything else and you're into your makeup and just looking a bit more polished in regards to like your appearance then this is a good find they also have the matte version so i definitely want to pick that one up but regardless I think this is a good holly around product to have as well i don't know but for some reason i didn't really know about blotting paper like this is a completely new find to me and i was just there searching on the internet the other day and i came across like somebody using chanel blotting papers i'm like chanel blotting papers like what is that and i went ahead googled and I found a cheaper alternative on Amazon, trusted on Amazon. So this is what they're looking like. It's just small little sheets 
that you can just use to pat on your face if like throughout the day you're out your face is getting a bit too greasy too much sheen and you don't like it like that who does then this is what you're looking like it does come in a little wallet you just pat it on and it just soaks up all the excess grease sweat anything that's on your face that you don't want on there just like pat it down and you're good to go another product that i've been loving for the summer is this elf monochromatic multi stick so this i got it from the super jug beauty events that i vlogged a couple of weeks ago and i'm like you know what? let me just give it a try and i'm loving it so this is the color the same color that you see outside that's the true color of it and a little goes a long way so i just use it like on my lips trying to get into blush so this is a good little way to like not necessarily just buy a blush product just for blush but you can use this to like get into your blushes use it on your lips anything that eyeshadow is so versatile and i feel like the color on it is like so pretty pretty or rustic orange that is perfect for the summer time so yeah definitely value for money and i feel like this is something that i would rebuy i would definitely want to see if they have different colors available though because it's good to like you know explore try out different products try out different colors and don't stuck in one box but this i feel like it would work on so many skin colors regardless of your complexion your race whatnot it will look good on everyone and last but not least we have our good old feminine wipes so this is a product that you need to have in your bag all year round all year round some are not this needs to be in your bag if you don't i'm looking at you sideways like girl what is going on with you like you don't have that little wipes and i'm looking at own like i'm not judging but i'm judging i'm judging but yeah for the summer season this is something that definitely needs to be in your bag just because like you know it's hot outside we're sitting a bit more just to like tidy up keep everything nice and fresh fresh keep everything nice and fresh you need to have like good little uh, feminine wipes this is the brand that was available in super Drug, so that's why i just picked it up but yeah those are all the products that i'm currently loving for the summer season and they've definitely helped to like maybe just feel a bit more confident in my skin going out because i'm someone that has so many imperfections on my skin like any little bit i can do to help in regards to that i'm going to do so with that being said hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to go ahead like comment and subscribe subscribe so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video so until then take care bye